All right, ladies and gentlemen, Lena feels good, everyone. Now, guys, I was watching a clip on TikTok. It was a video. And they were saying that, like, this one person was like, would name a celebrity that is very attractive to everyone that you don't think is attractive or whatever. Like, that people are, like, surprised that you don't think are attractive. So... This one girl was like, she's like, I know I'm not that attractive, but that's where she started it. <coughs> Sorry, guys. She's like, I know I'm not that attractive, but I do feel that some celebrities, I just don't find them attractive. And everybody finds them attractive. So she started spewing them off. And she named maybe five or six or seven of them. And I think one of them was um, Natalie Portman. The other one, I think, was Paul Rudd. I think, I don't remember the, the, anybody else, like Natalie Portman was one of them, and she's like, she just doesn't do anything for me, whatever, you know, so, I, and for me, as you guys know, I, I have no problem, I don't do it in a dramatic way, I'm not, I'm not thinking the celebrity will be upset with me, because I always say things later to make sure they know I'm not, you know, trying to be rude, or anything, and they know I'm being polite, um, so, and they know that I would never, Rude to, I never say anything to the ch on their channel. If I met them, I wouldn't be like, oh, you don't look that good. You know, I never say that. You know, but I do say on you, because people judge celebrities freely. They don't worry about what they say about celebrities. Um, not because it's, uh, it, you know, it might be wrong, but that's how people are with celebrities. So I was saying whatever I felt. So anyway, there were, you know, I might as well tell you guys now, there are some celebrities that just are like, and I mentioned it many times, but I'll say them in this one video. Some of them, I'm not, I won't mention all of them, but there's some stories that just don't, I just don't find that attractive. So one, one of them, and yeah, so the video that they were doing was who do you find not attractive in Hollywood that everybody finds attractive. So it's okay. So one of them is Brad Pitt. Now Brad Pitt is very, very attractive. And some of them I see on like, yeah, he looks really, really good. I just never had like this whole idea that he was like my type of guy like I date both guys and girls but I didn't think he was really my type of guy I mean he's good looking for sure I mean if he did ask me out maybe he would I don't know maybe I'll go to Hollywood and he'll ask me out but maybe I would go out with him but I think it's mainly the stories that I hear about him you know he's very He's very, he's very much a commercial product in a sense that I would, I don't, like every time he does a movie, I don't find his personality that interesting. Every time he does whatever, I just find his personality and the choices of movies he does is not matching my type of what a person that I like to date or that I like to be around does. Not to say that if he did ask me out, would I say yes? Maybe I would, I mean, I know. I don't usually think of Brad Pitt as someone who's going to ask me out, but I'm very good looking, maybe he would, right? But, I mean, for, as far as it stands now, I just don't think he's my type of attractive, based on his personality. And he's very attractive physically, but not my 100% my type of attractive. He's probably like, I would say he's an 8 out of 10 for looks. And I'm like, I'm there are some people that I think are 10 out of 10, lots of people that I think are 10 out of 10, enough of them that I think there's a lot of them. Anyway, somebody else that I don't think is that attractive. Natalie Portman, I think she's right about that. I just never found Natalie Portman to be that attractive. I just, I mean, she does beautiful, she's always like the big star. She's always seen as like the most beautiful in the role she played out of the rest of the actors. But I just never really found her to be that attractive. I found her personality to be very much like a, a girl that I would never date. I don't think she's someone that I would ever date. She doesn't look pretty enough. I know it's odd to say that because she's very, very pretty, but I just don't think she is. All right, somebody else. So, uh, let's see. Whitey 18. I know Whitey 18 is very young. I usually don't date people that are that young. I, mean, I probably have in the past, but not, I don't usually, like I'm 42 now. I like maturity. Maturity, maturity is important to me. Uh, so yeah, so Whitey 18, I mean Whitey 18 definitely is a good looking guy for sure, but I, I'm, like for him, even for him, like it's not like, it's not like I can really, I, I find him not someone that I would even consider, like at least with Brad Pitt, 
there is that whole thing where if you did ask me, maybe I would. Whitey 18 is not my type at all. Not my type at all. Even though he looks like Brad Pitt, maybe when he gets older, he'll be my type. But right now, as far as it stands, I don't find him attractive at all, like in my perspective. I recognize he's very attractive to most other people, but I don't understand it for some reason. I just don't know why people find him so attractive. But, I mean, he's very popular. I really think it's a great thing that he's super popular, that he's doing very, very well, that everybody finds him attractive. I just don't see why. But I don't think it's a big deal. I mean, I don't think people care what I think. <laughs> they'll, they'll like him regardless. But anyway, that's what I think of YD18. Oh, another girl. Let's see. What girl is very attractive? Oh, Cardi B. Cardi B, her personality, she just doesn't... I wouldn't date her either. Her personality just seems so... You know, like it's, it's, it's almost like, it's almost, I mean, she's got a really good voice for singing. I love her songs. She's got that edginess in the songs that makes the song a song really, really good. I just don't find her talking very, like she always sounds like she's into drama. And I know she's fighting off haters, so she's, she's, some of that really like her though. Like some of she's really, really, really pretty. She's got a really good glam look going on lots of times. Other times I just think, you know, and, and maybe, maybe it's because she, I mean, obviously I don't judge someone from being pregnant, but maybe she gained weight because she was pregnant, and I don't see her the same way. But she is really, really beautiful. Uh, don't get me, and of course when she's pregnant, she still looks good. She's just pregnant. Uh, but something about her personality, I just, something's off with it for my taste. But I mean, she is really gorgeous for sure. Anyway, thank you for watching right now.